this is Patricia, Hospital Metro Nakuru Memorial. We have just received uh, some consignment from KEMSA. We normally get support from the government on uh, ARVs because we have a CCC, that is Comprehensive Care Clinic here in uh, War Memorial, which is free. So we normally get ARVs free of charge. And this morning, our delivery has just come. And uh, unfortunately, I'm not able to get it inside just because orders from above have it that I can't access the stamp. So now these are the papers, the drugs. The drugs are here plus others, but uh, it's so unfortunate that uh, instructions are I should not go in at all. All I wanted is just access to get the stamp and do official receipt of this. I have over 200 clients and uh, missing this critical drug is very serious. I feel so sad because even if I go in today and I don't have these drugs, then it means somebody today is going to miss his or her ALVs. The person who has brought uh, the drugs to us, officially it has to be received. And the official way is to put my signature and the stamp. He cannot go back without a stamp. I've called the relevant authority and I've been told it's a no. I can't not go in. So now we have to take them back. I don't know until when. Yeah. Yes, they have been calling. They have been calling for, I've had clients who have been calling for the supply, for the drugs. Yeah. So I knew today at least they are going to come for the supply. But now this is where we are. Sio cha kupita mbele ya kamera. Sasa 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 ako ako cha mbele. Sasa 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 kwa mbele. Nani ako ta kwa mbele? Ya kwa
Tunakuja. Tunakuja. Sitarijeni hapo. Tunakuja hapa. Wewe? Utajua leo mjui. Tunakuja hapa ndani.
that gate is open, that crowd gets in here. Yeah. So we are open there. We will mess up there. Are you the one who arranged for for the you know, for those other members of the public? No. I don't know. Even no when we one. came, there was no one. We saw no one. Actually, no they have come, come shortly before you came alive. Yes. So then, we were just the police for them the this money, and I think it's some politician who's paying. Then we can build some a few areas, and then we will convert to make a decision mm -hmm. on the way for them. So, so, yes. so, so. so you guys just. Hmm? <laughs> 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 Ben, Ben, Ben. Ça a été un peu mon père. Tu peux te faire un peu de temps. Tu peux te
Mimi ni Patricia Msale na mimi ni Hospital Metron Administrator na Kurwa Memorial. It has been a long journey. Uh, it has been a journey that has taken us 13 days. Today is the 13th day. And tumeona uh, mkono wa Mungu because it has come to an end. I have managed to uh, to get into the hospital through the right channel. We had uh, the county commander. He has come and he has opened the gate for us. As you can see, this is War Memorial. This is the main entrance. So I can proudly say that we are in. Na ini mkono wa Mungu. It has not been easy. We have been uh, out there for 13 days in the sun and uh, we have been very patient waiting and the time has come. Now we are here. Uh, we are yet to do proper assessment of uh, whatever may be missing but uh, from the outlook like the linen, I don't know where the linen is because normally our beds are usually well made but uh, I could note that most of the beds they just have a mattress and a bed without the linen but uh, we'll go through with my staff so that we can do proper inventory of whatever may have been lost. There are some areas we had locked when we were chased away and uh, most of them have confirmed they are still locked. But still we'll have to go in and uh, verify that everything is okay. Ukizungumza kwamba operations zimeresume na tunaona kwamba ni wewe tu na wakili ambao mnaweza ku access the facility. Okay, um, at the moment, I am a peke yangu, but my colleagues wako kapale kwa mlango because the matter should, watu wanakuru wamejitokeza, wamejitokeza, I can't tell from where, but we had a very good, a very big group of people there, so we couldn't, they couldn't be allowed in because of other reasons, so my staff are there, but uh, the county commander is going to assist, assist them so that he can join me. Maybe in the next 10 minutes, they will be with me. What does this mean to the entire fraternity? Oh, this is a relief. It's a relief and we thank God and I hope it will never ever happen again. We should not go through this, especially the staff and the patients. It should not happen again. Uh -huh. We didn't expect it to happen, we didn't expect it. So when it happened, it caught us unaware, but we are prayerful and we are hopeful that it won't happen again. It's going to be the second and the last time. Kwa majina ni Charles Nyanaro uh, Wakati huu tume receive court order Tume ishimu court order Na lime withdraw maskari Sasa tume kubati kutoka Na sasa tume achia Wenye facility Sasa sisi Tume fika wakati wa kutoka Thank you so much Mwati ni unge?